Hello, hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I was just doing my makeup. I was getting ready for today, uh, and I thought that I could just film a chilled vlog with y'all, and uh, we could chill together and keep it chilled, and it'll all be really, really chilled. <laughs> so you might have read by the title, I am going to make pizza because we love pizza so i'm really excited because i've actually been wanting to do this for really long like uh you know make a pizza by myself the tricky part is that i'm gonna be making everything from scratch the dough the sauce and that's it <laughs> i'm gonna make everything from from scratch I've put so much blush, oh my god! Once I'm done with my makeup, we'll go and get some groceries that I need for the pizza. I kind of tried to keep like a simple look. I wanted to go all subtle because I was just at home. But I ended up doing my whole face. I'm not even gonna do my eyebrow today. My brows are so out of shape. So it's better that I don't do anything. I think for my eyes, I'm gonna keep it very simple. The next step is mascara, which is my favorite step because um, if I leave my house without mascara, I sometimes just look in the mirror and I'll be like, something is off. And then I realize that it's because I haven't applied mascara. So today I'm using my all-time favorite mascara. It's the L'Oreal Paris Lash Paradise Mascara. And I read somewhere that even Beyonce has used this. And I feel like that's reason enough to get it because this is this is like an international product that is now available in India and I love the packaging. So as you can see, I've applied one coat of mascara and there's no mascara on this eye. This has got wavy bristles that actually make such a dramatic difference to your lashes just in one coat. They are very dense and they hold a lot more formula than a regular brush. And they also coat like each and every individual lash. That's why you get that, you know, really natural lash lift effect. It's actually a very affordable brush for the quality of the product. Since I don't like to wear false lashes, I really like this mascara. I'm sorry, I have the mascara face throughout while talking it also has a waterproof smooth glide balmy formula it does not smudge and it doesn't even clump up just came by the window to show you my lashes it looks so natural and it gives such a nice lifted effect i love it it's also got rose oil and castor oil which helps your lashes grow and it gives it the nourishment that it needs and if you want to check the mascara out all the details will be mentioned in the description so don't forget to check it out i really like the product and uh, yeah the best part is that it works for both types of people the ones that want like a natural look and if you want like a heavy lash effect you can like layer up layer it up over each other like a bunch of coats and you will get the result i love it you can check out all the details in the description and now let's go get our groceries Guess who's back? Back again. Guess who's back? Back again. <laughs> Guys, tell me honestly. You all missed my kitchen videos now. I knew it. <laughs> I felt like I haven't um, done like a cooking type video on my channel for really long. You've already read by the title. I thought we'd make pizza from scratch. But you must be wondering, Ashna, you were wearing some other t-shirt some time back and now you've changed. Oh my god, that's an insect and it's really big. I'm gonna try and ignore it. Okay, so yeah, let me tell you. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, 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 BRB. Okay, I don't know where the fly went, but as I was saying, you guys must be wondering uh, why is my t-shirt changed? Um, and if you're not wondering also, I'll let you know that it's actually the next day. Yesterday was, I'm hungry, I'm having yogurt as we chat. Yesterday was actually a really big fail. I didn't vlog when I went to buy groceries because uh, there was music playing and I would get copyright. So I didn't vlog there. Then I came back home and because I was shooting the whole day, we started making the pizza somewhere around 8 o'clock. We tried it the first time and then my uh, flour was uh, kharab. We had a little problem. My maida, um, it turned out that it was really old maida. So 
so we had to get new maida from the store so i had to go buy new uh, maida and then by the time we bought the new maida the yeast was uh, in the water for really long so the first batch got screwed up i don't know what went wrong but the consistency was really bad and then we started again the whole process of making the dough and then it was a fail again i don't know what the problem was i still don't know what went wrong but i'm back again because mummy ne sikhaya hai ki give up nahi karte today i found a different recipe and we're not going to add yeast so here is a list of all the ingredients that i'm using for the dough and the process is also pretty simple okay i've tied my hair because it's so hot i don't know why um i feel i had to close the windows because street noise bahut zyada thi but um we are about to start so all you need is a bowl uh, of hot water i'll also leave the recipe in the description so you can cross check with your measurements but you need to uh, get a bowl of warm water and then add in sugar salt and baking powder i hope baking powder does the trick i'm going to mix everything in the water first we have to start adding our flour i'm going to add little by little not the whole thing at once if you add the whole thing it will be very difficult to mix it So so far I'm very happy with my dough it's looking nice I still have my hands stuck in it so I'm I put my board over here and the remaining flour that's there I'm going to remove all of it put it on the board and then mix uh, all of this I have a very good feeling it's looking good sorry I have one hand busy but I'm also going to add uh, this which is the oh you can see my pajamas but i'm going to add this which is the garlic like crunchy garlic bit so it's going to give it like a garlic bread feel like for the pizza base so i'm going to add that to this dough only this is what the garlic seeds look like the orange bit okay so i've put flour on the board so that it does not stick yes i think guys i think this is looking good today if i do accomplish this i'll be very proud of myself I broke a glass but anyway guys I am so proud of myself I made a pizza dough The real test is once the pizza is made though but the dough yesterday it was so difficult and I was like so disappointed by the end of the night but I have my dough look at that look at that ball Now the next step is uh the tomato sauce. So while I make the tomato sauce I'm going to keep the dough in a bowl. So as you can see I have a plain bowl here it's smaller because i broke the medium size one <laughs> but uh anyway i'm going i've already put olive oil as you can see i'm going to brush like the sides also it's too small but we can't help it i have a small bowl only to fit it basically we have to just cover it in olive oil so that it doesn't stick it's time for our tomato sauce Turn your gas on. What's up, guys? Can you please recommend some Netflix things to watch? We just finished The Office yesterday. Oh my God! Me and Kushi have bawled our eyes out. We were crying. And when Michael comes in the last episode, oh my God! Okay. I don't want to spoil it for anyone who hasn't watched The Office, but I feel like I'm the only person who's not watched The Office yet. Let's add butter. <laughs> There is no particular recipe for the tomato sauce. It's actually a bunch of videos that I've watched and I've understood what they've done and now I'm just going to do it my way. I don't have a proper recipe to give you all. Just make a tomato puree of four or five tomatoes and then I also have this um canned tomato thing that has uh, onion, garlic and uh, basil already. That's my butter going 
all the videos that i've watched for the tomato sauce a lot of them recommended to use canned tomatoes as well because tomatoes are khatta sometimes by themselves and then to you know to get it to that flavor it just doesn't happen sometimes like it feels like you're having ghar ka tomatoes so we don't want that we want it to be a little fancy we've already got the butter i'm going to add the tomato for the extra tomatoes from this one i feel like it's diced so i'm going to add the uh, how much am i feel for our quantity this can has about 400 grams this is the normal tomato and this is the canned tomato there's so much color in that one so i feel like that is why I, that is why most people recommend to add it i don't know this smells amazing Did you all guess that song? <laughs> that was I knew you were trouble when you walked in by Taylor Swift. Oh, I love jamming to songs and cooking. It's kind of therapeutic. I think you should try it. Uh, I'm very happy with my sauce now. It was very cut out, by the way, in spite of adding the other one. So I added sugar. Sugar cuts down the acidity. Then I added salt and uh, mirchi masala because. the indian in me wants spices so you can add jitna bhi masala you want i also added one cheese slice i think the next step is to bello the atta i mean the dough a lot of people that have already made pizza or they are chefs and you are watching this video i'm really sorry you will be cringing the whole time because i have no technique and i have no knowledge about how a pizza is made so i don't know making your own food is just it makes me really happy i think i'll be able to make two pizzas out of this dough so let's see see my dough ha na kitna acha banana it's so much better than last time can you all taste and tell me agar ye barabar hai so i added sugar full only she had yaar bacha ko chaat hai no no that one. Is this also okay? It's khatta gaya. Thoda sa after taste khatta hai abhi tak. Hai na? But oh baaki I've added a lot of sugar. It's still khatta. Please don't make don't. Oh. <laughs> Why would you do that? getting tired of pizza and banana aata nahi anyway so this is the pan that i have i'm going to grease the pan with olive oil let's go why see this color actually wouldn't come if we use just kharka tomato that canned tomato i use na now we'll uh, add the cheese this is done the sauce sure it looks like a real pizza yaar wow and then i got this cheese also so let's i can't believe this looks like an actual pizza mujhe put hole it looks like an actual pizza place oh my god we cannot believe the final result we are getting to have pizza today if it turns out good now मेरे सारे पाप ए फ्यू मोमेंट्स लेटर सो आई द पिज्जा वाज गेटिंग डन आई वाज फिल्मिंग फॉर डैम फैम दैट वीडियो विल ऑलरेडी बी अप बाय द टाइम यू आर वाचिंग दिस सो गो चेक दैट आउट बड़ा पिज्जा इज रेडी एंड इट स्मेल्स अमेजिंग एंड इट लुक्स लाइक अ प्रोफेशनल पिज्जा गाइस आई एम सरप्राइज्ड इट लुक्स अमेजिंग फील इट लुक्स लाइक अ थिन क्रस्ट टाइप बट ओ माय गॉड एंड गेस व्हाट वी आर प्री हीटिंग द ओवन बिकॉज़ ईशा has made cake which uh the recipe is already on our IGTV so check that out she's also made ice cream because uh, Isha made the recipe at our cousin's house so we did not get to eat it me and Kushi <laughs> so now she's making it for us so it's a pizza and a uh, brownie ice cream night for us Woo guys as soon as the pizza came it was gone <laughs> we ate it so fast <laughs> 
<laughs> we were so hungry and uh, that's why I couldn't show much but uh, I took a few clips on my phone so here's the magic And now we are having brownie with ice cream. By the way, the brownie and the ice cream is all homemade. Isha made it, and she posted a video on her IGTV. If you want to try it out, it is yum. Look at us. We are. We just bought the whole thing out of the tray, right? Out of the tray, and here we are having ice cream and that. Oh my god! So guys, I. Feel like I should end the video here. I've had a fun time. I hope you enjoyed as well. Um, the shoutouts for today go to Madhya Kadri and uh, Shivani Nandekar. Thank you so much for subscribing. If you want a shoutout in my next video, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel and comment on this video telling me that you have. I will see you again next time. Please, please, please subscribe. We are very close to 600k. Thank you once again. Love you all. Bye.